What's up, friendly survivors? This is KJ48, and welcome back to our Seven Days to Die Husband and Wife Let's Play with Friends. Um, this is episode nine, and we're here with Pam. Hi there. And Ono Koho. Hello, hello. And Autumn. Hi. And Bish. Good day. How's everybody doing today? Very good. Pretty good. good. Very, very good, yeah. All right, so um, Pam and I did some, and I think Autumn was here too, we did some yep. farming off camera. Uh, I'm playing a lot of versions of this game, and I don't remember what we did. Do you remember what we did? I, I know we did some mining, and I was doing some exploring, right? But mining, exploring, um, well, you you had started out coming back from where you had been in the town. And, okay, I, uh, I never found the town on camera, though. Um, I think no, I, I th no, no, where you guys had been at the end. Yeah, I think I was around. Town. I think I was around this house, guys, and I just continued following the road, um, and I found a I found a town right here, um, and I did some looting, and I made a mistake, and I'm gonna let Pam uh, talk about that. So anyway, as you probably all remember from previous episodes, we had agreed that although Cage would get the majority of the books um, to start with, because he would always be here in every um episode um that there would be books that myself like the steel book and the concrete book or autumn would would need for our jobs so um cage found a steel book which was great it's cage uh muscle madness or memory or whatever madness is read the, the steel book <laughs> yeah like i i was just about done with that born and noble it was in the town in the south I was just about done with the Born and Noble, and I was like, eh, this has not been a really good Born and Noble. And the, I think it was the last the last bookcase gave me the steel book, and I was in such euphoria. Um, muscle memory, you know, I'm used to just learning recipes. I play mostly single player, and I wasn't thinking straight, and I used the steel book. So I got a little upset with that because that was, like, my job, and there's almost no reason for me to be here at all if I can't be making and crafting. So... I told Cage that I wanted him to spawn me in a steel book and then he couldn't go near near steel until one more steel book was found that he could then destroy or reread or whatever and then he could know steel so that I could have my job. Yeah, the, the Pam's only job in this series is to craft and not have not, not getting her the steel book was a major a major mistake of mine. So in order to rectify that, I basically spawned in a steel book, and I'm not allowed to make anything with steel. As far as I'm concerned, my character does not know steel. I cannot make anything with steel, um, and I cannot repair anything with steel. Uh, so that's where we're at right now. Anyway, yeah. back to the story. So um, Back to the game. Yeah. Story's over. Back to the game. So we're going to... Basically, what we want to do is, guys, we're going to be looking for a place to build... Our, by the way, ABC always be crafting. I'm in the middle of crafting gunpowder. Um, we're gonna find. A, we're gonna look for a flat area to make the base with. Now I have an idea for a base. Um, it's basically gonna be what we're gonna have to do is dig a large hole, a very large hole. It doesn't have to go very deep. It probably go down to just stone, um, but it's got to be pretty wide. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a base inside of it. It's gonna be like something like a 13 by 13, maybe a 15 by 15, really big base. Okay. And then what we're going to do is um, the, the the hole is going to be even farther out from the base. We're going to dig the base down to the stone where, like, inside the hole. I, I've seen Granger do this before, and anyone who knows Granger has seen his, seen his streams might know the um, the base I'm, I'm talking about. But either way, uh, basically what it's going to be is that the, the base walls are going to go completely down the stone. There's going to be a, a basically a trench around it that's going to be probably about five spots out, possibly seven. We'll have to see how that goes. Um, and then what we're going to do is we're going to make murder holes at the bottom. Uh, we're going to have like, kind of like, we're going to have a basement that we don't build in. We just go down there to kill. And the zombies are going to walk off and they're going to fall down the hole. And we're going to go down and kill them. We're also going to have above, we're going to have, um, you know, the, uh, the, the, the iron bars going sideways so we can look down on them and shoot as well. You know, kind of like we did with the base, um, in the sub server. Oh God, I play too many worlds guys. So that's the, that's the basic idea for the base. That's what I've got in my head so far, and uh, I think it's going to be really cool. But we got to get to work because I know I know Alpha 14 is not coming out in February. That was ridiculous, but it will come out, and um, we got a lot of work to do. So we got to get down to business. It's time to get the business. Business. By the way, I am finding a butt load of iron down here. Like, 
I know I was struggling to find iron at the beginning. Now it's an abundance. Yeah, it's... you've gotten you've gotten turned into the green area, so that's why. Yeah. And it's funny that I found most of the iron while I have the steel pickaxe. It's a good luck charm. You guys might be wondering why I missed that deer so much. I was I was contem oh I was compensating for arrow drop that wasn't really happening. Um just kinda like basically like testing it. I was trying to see. Bolts don't seem to drop really at all. Like oh. 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 What I really want to find is the goddamn spike club schematic. I miss my spike club. Crap. Oh, another thing, um, you guys, uh, reprimanded me in the comments for breaking up, uh, uh, breaking up schematics, uh, that other people could use, and in my, like, in my justification of that, in my own mind, I was like, well, I don't have a lot of room, you know, I mean, I I'd be going back to town constantly, but what I'm gonna start doing is I'm gonna start making, uh, drop-off chests outside any Born and Noble, pretty much, and then that way I could just drop the stuff in the drop-off chest. You guys are totally right. Um, oh no, Coho reamed me out. Um, he, he smacked me around a little bit. And, uh, I don't know if he was drunk or what, but... It, I don't know, like, he was... Is he ever so... His hockey you? team lost, he was out of maple syrup, and he just went off. And he took it out on me. So... So I won't do... I will make sure I don't do that again, okay, guys? That's right. I promise. I promise. You learned your lesson. I, well, we're, we're having we're having to teach Cage how to play multiplayer. The guy yeah. is in a, a single player rut. Yeah, yeah. So, I, and my original thing was I don't have room, I don't have time, I'm not going back to base. That's that. But no, I mean I can just make a drop off chest. It only takes a little bit of wood. There's no reason not to. And then what we do is we put them in front of every born and noble, you know, maybe every town, and you just you only put schematics in there, only schematics. And then that way, you know, people know when they if they see a born and noble, if they see a chest out front, instead of going to the born and noble, they could just check to see if there's any schematics down. All right, I need to come back upstairs for a little bit. Pam, there is deer everywhere. I'm trying to kill them, but they're freaking hopping around like a little punk asses. Little bunny rabbits. They do. Oh, I shot that one right in the right in the ass. Right he, in he, the he, ass. He didn't like that. You know what we Big need? We need juicy ass. We need a um a knife book too, because this bone shiv's getting on my nerves. Okay. Now, Pam, where is all the iron going? Iron, but in those building boxes by the forges. Thank the supply you. chest. And stone's going in there, too. Yeah, I see that. I'm making, I'm making open more. Open another cards. stone box. I'm making more gravel. <laughs> okay, I don't have a box for gravel. Well, I just put the gravel in there. That I'm making a box, separate box for gravel, but you can put it where the other gravel is right now. I'll stop my production of gravel, because literally I'm going to have, like, 500 of it. Well, more than 500, like... Oh, that's not hardly any gravel. Yeah, 500 is nothing, but... With the amount of rocks I was going to make, it was going to be a lot more than just 500. <laughs> no, like... we need, like, tens of that. Like, several, probably 10,000 gravel. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me put my coal. Do you want the coal over here in this chest over here, or do you want it in one of those? A chest with a coal in the bottom? Oh, yeah. Uh, That's okay. where the gravel goes in the bottom, too. Oh, okay. Do you need more mushroom seeds? Because, like, take up one yes, spot in my inventory. Yes. Do you have mushroom seeds? We have one mushroom seed. All right. You don't need much. Well, how many seeds do you get from breaking down a mushroom? Uh, two. Yeah. All right, we'll see. Like, keeping an inventory spot for one mushroom seed might not be okay, but we'll see. I got three people with me when I eventually get there, so we'll we'll see if we can make it work. Plus, you know, the fact that we can make mushrooms at all, we got a, a leg up on everybody else. Oh, that reminds me. Everyone's been asking me about the uh, the mods. Do you want to... Yeah. Do you want to... Again? No, no, in the comments. They want, they want the mod thing. Is it an XML thing you did, or...? Yeah, it's XML... It's mod, mods that I XML mods I wrote. So can you? Is there a way we could put that up on Dropbox like we did with the Hunger Food Meter, or is it maybe too complicated? It's, or it's a little bit more complicated. I mean, I can put them up there, but they're going to have to follow directions because just just for the um, 
farming mod means you have to go in and take the code that I wrote and insert it into your XML files and you have to change item IDs and everything to match your XML files. And if somebody doesn't know what they're doing, they could really screw themselves up. But I like you couldn't just code. you couldn't just put your XML file up there. I could, but then it would overwrite all theirs, and they would have to put they would have to put all all of my mods in. And if they have anybody else's mods in, it would overwrite those mods. Okay. Well, I mean, if you want to do that, feel free. I'm not going to ask you to though, because that does sound like a lot of work. Uh, it, but maybe we should just get your XML file up there with a warning of like this will override everything. You, if you put this in there, you're going to be playing the exact game we play on this. Because I, I bet you a lot of people, most people watching this video, would be perfectly fine with the just overriding everything and just you know, as long as they're okay, we aware can do of that. it. Yeah, yeah. Because they. Yeah, they just have... so you know, we have a couple of zombies out front, yeah. but uh, yeah. they're they're just kind of going on to the spike, so we're we're okay as long as the the frames aren't down. Oh. They are. <laughs> yeah, the frames are down. Sorry, they're going I, on the spot I didn't like think I didn't think bring pick up frames would be a big deal at this time of day. Can you pick the frames up? Or do you need me to come pick them up? I most they, of them are dead. I'll so bet you they can't get up those frames anyway. They'll probably try and fall on the spikes anyway. Yeah, they one of them did and then the other one is just dead. So we're good. Were they screamers? No. Oh, there were three dudes. Three dudes. I picked the frames up. Yeah, I'll pick the frames up. Oh, I did already. Oh, you already did. Oh, cool. No, don't roll down the hill. Oh, Grady disappeared. Eh, whatever. Alright. If animals or zombies get moved from the place they die, they disappear. I don't know if you guys noticed that. And they don't disappear, they're just invisible. Like I, I, I had a couple screen, um, a couple uh, ferals I killed, and a cop puked on them, and they it, like they it moved their corpse, and when they landed, they went invisible. It's, it's happened repeatedly. It doesn't happen every time, but it happens a lot. Where do you want potassium nitrate, Pam? Uh, in this box here that I'm making. Let me finish making it. Oh yeah, you're fine. Sorry, I didn't know if that was what you were doing. So. Oh man. I know we just got started, but my back already hurts. <laughs> I'm actually actually feeling a lot better. I'm probably not going to stream tonight till I go to Fat Planets because uh, my back was in excruciating pain last night. No, oh, people are going to be upset. I know, I know. Seven days to die for two nights. I know, and a weekend too. I, I hate to do it, but I can't. Cause... I'm going to be upset. I know, I know. Why don't you stream, Pam? Because I'm just not set up to do it, and I can't stream when. Uh... Fire crushing. Oh, yeah, true. It looks like you have, like, a stone hanging right off of, like, your arm. Uh, there's a stone in my hand. Yeah. <laughs> it just looks funny, because it's just, like... It was just behind you, floating. Alright, guys, you gotta get your, uh... Your pickaxes and axes and shit. Let's kill this zombie first. Pissing me off. Oh, he's up top, isn't he? All right. You might just want to, uh, Autumn. You just might want to make a box downstairs for yourself and put stone in there, and not even worry about carrying it up right now, because I got more than I can cook right now. Yeah, exactly. Do you guys need Do you guys need food or drink or anything? I'm infected. <clears throat> All right. I'm putting your pickaxes, your axes, four antibiotics for the two of you. Do you need any food or drink? Uh, no more medical and anything. Do you need healing items? Yeah, uh, I'm good for healing items. I just I'm only to... I'm 58. So All right, there's six there's use... six uh, pills in there, and um... also I've got oh a, green alcohol. Uh... Hold on. Oh, can you repair yeah. my crossbow? Yeah. All right, hey, there's Jeff, there's, there's um there's ten green alcohol in there. I've got two presents for you in the bottom locker. Okay, make sure you um in the work oh, in sweet. the in the working mini stiffs mini bike in the guyver book. I think I already got both of them. Oh, okay. I got the mini bike uh, one on stream the other day. Well, sweet. 
Um, McDivers, what is that? Scrap? What is it called? Scrap armor or scrap? Yeah, armor, yeah, yeah. I wouldn't mind that if nobody else. Wants okay, it. yeah, I got both, so I'll I'll save them for Pam. That'll be my. I'll have to learn, you know. Uh, did you did you split up all the stuff I put in that locker between the two of you? Uh, I grabbed half. All right, yeah. Go ahead, make sure you guys get everything out of there. Uh, can you repair my crossbow? It's oh yeah, working stiff's crate. Got it. Cool, thanks. Whoa. Bishop and I met uh, heavy resistance. You got any wood? Way. I do. I need some wood to repair it. There yeah, you, you guys are pretty battle worn here. <laughs> Alright, that's going to take 40 seconds. Oh, okay. Cool. Right. Is that, has this whole thing been looted? I was outside. Uh, Dan, Dan's house. I, I was outside for most of it, so. Uh, the downstairs part definitely has. Not the upstairs, bit, though. Oh, that's why you need the pickaxes and shit. Oh, there he is. Um, Cage. Yeah. Turn around, look behind you, and up. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> yeah, oh, he's kind, of he's kind of trapped, so I'm just ignoring him. I, I was like, why is why do I keep hearing a zombie? And it's like. He's up there in the rafters. <laughs> <laughs> he just got fucked up. And now, it, oh, dude, now he's just a shadow. Oh, now hey, he's, he if you go at a certain angle, he's only a shadow. Oh. And now there's just a piece of him. That's weird. yeah. There's a weird. Oh, that's cool. Here, oh no, take this. Okay. Cool. Thanks. Yep. Yeah. Did you guys see my single player episode when I got stuck up there? Yeah. It was pretty funny. <laughs> I'm like, you gotta be shitting me. <laughs> Do either of you like the sledgehammer? No. God no. God no. Okay, I'm breaking them up. Then. In real life, I do, but not in the game. They really screwed that that weapon up, and they don't seem to care. Oh, we should get oh, that. Oh, 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 go 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 go! Oh shit, you guys broke down the wrong door, damn you. Oh, son of a diddly. <laughs> Mining skill is 91. Oh, that's close. Where is it? What? Yeah. You guys continue looting. We don't all need to go get it, I guess. Oh, I can't break from this side. How's your inventory? Uh, it's good enough. Uh... Okay. Well, Bishop's been looting more than I have, so he's probably. Uh... Okay. I gotta get back to that drop off. I gotta get back to my drop off. You got a drop off chest in this town? Yep. Yeah. Yeah, okay. uh, just over yonder. By, by it's the uh, west. You put a waypoint the, uh... for it, right? Oh, yeah. Uh, not yet. Yeah, put a waypoint and then share it. That's what the mechanics are there for. Okay, so we've pretty Good well enough. done this uh, water plant, right? Yeah, what we're going to do, guys, watching the videos is we're going to, we want to, I don't know if I mentioned this, but uh, we want to find a spot that's going to be flat for the building, and but we want it to be as close to the hub city as possible. Now, that water plant might be the spot, but we're going to actually go to the hub city and see if there's a closer, better spot. Um, so, we'll see. Oh my god. I hate the way going up hills is so damn slow. It's a drop-off waypoint. Awesome. Sweet. Oh, bear. To the northeast, Bishop, just so you know. Excellent. We're, we're being trolled by a bear. Bear troll. Bear troll. He doesn't look friendly. Normally, trolls never do. Yeah. It's not bad. True. Chainsaw recipe book. 10 oh. mil, which is crap, and iron Especially boots Especially when schematics. they're trapping over your wooden bridge. Sorry, what was the schematic? Iron boots. Oh, that's nice. Best armor you in the game? Bish? Oh, no, it's just an old, old school troll joke. The troll... Uh, There's a troll hunter there's like hiding a... under the bridge, right? With the, yes, the billy goats? Yeah. Are you trip trapping over my bridge? Yeah. <laughs> Pam, am I saving uh, armor schematics for you? Yes, please. Okay. 
I should have grabbed yep. a new pick before I went downstairs. The other trolls, that famous troll on the bridge in Monty Python, Holy Grail, where he asks King Arthur to answer the questions, and he, yeah, uh, yes. Asks him what the airspeed velocity of a swallow oh. is. <laughs> yes! An yes! unladen yeah. swallow? <laughs> African or European? <laughs> Uh, that one's great. Okay. I think we should... Uh, you guys... If you guys, uh... We should meet at the drop-off. Just drop off everything before we even start heading towards the hub city. I guess. Okay. Just, uh... Doing yeah. a quick, uh... We've got to be somewhat close to the mini bike too. I was gonna nail this passing guess. Oh, I can make both handlebars. We might be able to make the mini bike. What am I? I mean, we got tires are easy. We I know we have engines. I've I know we, I know we have batteries. I, I just got two forty one wheels right now. Yeah, I think we can make. make I mean, do you want to go back and make the? Uh, we might want to go back and make the. Well, only one person can use it. So, but we can make multiple. Well, we can only make as many engines and uh, and batteries as we have, I guess. Are There's you, a battery in the drop off kit. Pam, can you tell me how many batteries and engines we have at the base? Well, yeah, I'm looking. Just a second. The chests are kind of unorganized. I'm okay. looking. I, was I mean, if you, if you if you could even do that. the if you could even do the favor of take all the mini bike stuff out and put its own chest, that'd be awesome. We could yeah, I can do that. I can biker do that. gang. Yeah. Biker bi biker gang hype. <laughs> so is it true that if you put down uh, blocks, zombies cannot spawn on the blocks? I do not know. That. No, that's not true. And the reason I know that is see how many zombies have you seen uh, spawn on our causeway, and those are player-made blocks. Oh, and, and on the uh, garden. Yeah, yeah. So, no, that's... That's, uh, okay. that's busted. That's busted. That's a, that's a damn shame. I might still make all mine player made blocks i mean it couldn't hurt who knows maybe maybe it stops the majority of them i don't know because they keep uh they, i had zombies spawning in my um on my single player world inside my base and i'm really getting pissed off with that is anybody gonna read this smg schematic uh, i already i already read it <sighs> yeah, oh no oh no don't you like the smg uh yeah, I, you, bro. oh i can't see him Hang on a sec. <laughs> oh, he's outside. Sorry, we uh, we ran into some. We're taking care of some business here. Business. Business. Word. Never business. Business. Oh wow, we got a lot of feathers. I'm gonna make a bunch of arrows or bolts. Bolts. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> yes. Is some. It's Somebody could make me some bolts. That'd be awesome because I've got like four left. Yeah, I'm on it. Make sure you make bolts. <laughs> ah! Careful, there's a bear near the um, the plant. All right, let's set up a zero zero waypoint. Not a waypoint. I'm gonna put down a red marker. All right, I'm heading. I'm heading towards the hub city. All right, give us a sec. To, uh... Ah, stop it. Let's just drop off and go. Man, it's really far. Ow, I am the highest level right now. That's crazy. You guys might be wondering why I'm saving my points. Um, one thing I did take away from Pam is the gunsmithing thing. Um, I want to be the gunsmither. It's the only thing I ask. Uh, so like, um, she's gonna let me craft all the bullets. So I'm waiting to get the- <laughs> um, did agree on that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I agreed on it, so- yeah. I agreed on it for both of us. You'll, yeah. you'll, you'll come along to my way of thinking. It was one of those <laughs> kinds of agreements. Yeah. <laughs> it's the one thing I want. We want with everything else. <laughs> so, um, I'm just gonna wait. See, I don't know, is it better to spend your skill points on gunsmithing when you're low? Because it only takes like a couple points. Or is it better to, to... Just just make ammo. Make the ammo, okay. Well, I'm going to spend the skill points on it anyway, so... It would be cheaper to make the skill points on it now. 
I don't know. I guess I, I guess I will. It's a waste to use your level skill points on it because it goes up so fast once you start making ammo. I got nothing else to use them on. Especially on multiplayer. Alright guys, that was the timer, so we're going to call this one here. That is it for episode 9, and we'll see you next time for episode 10. Till then, take it easy. Bye! Bye! Bye-bye! Latest.